Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I cleaned and sanitized my top loading washing machine. So you guys, I am disgusted by this first and foremost. I just never really paid that much attention to my washing machine until my clothes started to smell and after inspecting further, I saw that my washing machine was disgusting. What the... Mm. So I'm going to show you guys how I naturally clean and sanitize my washer. So first you're going to need some white vinegar and you're also going to need some baking soda. I also recommend a glass measuring cup and just a smaller measuring cup for the baking soda. So first you're gonna take three to four cups of white vinegar. Next, you are going to add that vinegar directly to your washing machine. I'm just gonna open this little area because obviously it needs some extra TLC. And I'm just gonna dump it directly in there, not really being too mindful of spilling it. Now you are going to set your washer for the hottest setting, the heaviest setting, and the longest setting. This gives the mixture that you are going to combine time to penetrate all the areas of the washer, um, giving it that deep clean effect. So now is when you are going to measure out your half a cup of baking soda. And then once you have that added to the cup, you are going to add that directly into the vinegar water that is already in your washer. So as you can see here, there is a little bit of water already accumulating at the bottom of the washer. So you're just gonna take and sprinkle your baking soda all over the washer and into the water. Twelve seconds later. After just a few short minutes, some of the gunk and mold and mildew has already started to loosen up and the mixture is definitely doing its job. So before I let my washer finish its cycle, I am just gonna dip down and take some of that mixture of vinegar and baking soda and just scrub along the edges and anywhere that is gunky and dirty and built up on my washer. And then I'm just gonna take a little measuring cup and rinse it directly into the washer. As you can see here, the washer is spick and span. There is a no more brown, black, gunky buildup. Everything looks and smells clean and sanitized. And I am just really, really impressed with this overall experience. If you have a top loading washer, I highly recommend doing this process definitely more than i have done it we've had this washer and dryer set for two years now and this is the first time that i've ever gone to actually clean it and i have to say i am ashamed of myself and i will do better moving forward here is the washer without the sparkly filter but as you can see it is still clean it is still sparkly it is still shiny and it smells divine it no longer has that mildew smell that is often found in washers and i'm just really impressed with this whole experience and the fact that it's all natural so thank you guys so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and thanks for being my kind of weird bye